Well, Neil, we'll start off with uh, Sunday's game in the FA Cup. A good victory to see us through to uh, round two. Yeah, it was. Um, we had to fight hard for it. Um, but by the end of the game, it was relatively comfortable. Um, we did the job. We went to the next round of the competition. And judging by some of the other score lines and the amount of shocks there's been, um, we're thankful that we produced a good performance and now we go, we, now we go to Harrogate. And four wins in five now, does that show that, that the uh, training methods that you put in in pre-season and throughout the campaign are now starting to bear fruits and fruition? Um, I don't think there's been a massive amount of difference in terms of the level of performance um, recently. Um, the performance at the beginning of the season was, for large periods was very good. Um, the, the line between winning and losing is very, ma uh, very marginal, very thin. Um, and we've competed well in all our games. The players' spirit is excellent. And it, it's been nice for them to feel the, all their efforts has been rewarded recently. So there's a better feeling. There's more belief in what we're doing. Um, and we want that now to continue, obviously. And it's been an intense sort of four-week period. Have you been impressed with how the lads have, have dealt with that? Yeah, it's been an intense period of fixtures for us and there's more to come. Um, it's, um, you know, unique circumstances this season. Um, but I believe we've got a good squad, um, good depth in the quality we've got. If we have a bit of luck with the injuries and suspensions, then um, we'll, be, we'll be strong and stronger in the second half of the season. And um, that's why we want to stay in, all our, in the cup competitions as well. It's important and... Um, we want to breed that mentality that every game is important and the longer we stay in these competitions, the more games the players get to play with each other, where the cohesion can grow and the understandings and the relationships can grow. So um, tomorrow night against Leeds is another important game for us. And looking ahead to tomorrow night, any injury updates? Obviously there's a few injuries in camp, anyone likely to return? Yeah, possibly. Um, Keshi is trained and will train again today, so he'll come into contention. Um, possibly Oliver Sarkic as well. Uh, I think the game will probably just come a bit too soon for Luke Garbert, but he won't be too far away either. Um, Ethan Robson, obviously his suspension is now finished. Um, ben Woodburn will train, but he's not eligible because he's already played for Liverpool in the competition. So there's a few returning. Jordan Williams won't be uh, won't make it, and Matty Virtue won't make it yet, but. It's beginning to look a little bit healthier on the uh, on the injury front. And then lastly, looking ahead to tomorrow night, it's another good opportunity to get through to the next stage of another cup competition. Yeah, definitely, and that's um, something we stress to the players. We, even though Wembley seems a very, very long, long way away, um, it, it's still an opportunity to to play at Wembley, and, and this competition gives you that gives you that chance. Um, so we're in a decent position um, in the table and we know it's going to be in a, a tough game against Leeds tomorrow they've got some really talented youngsters um, play a similar way to the first team and if you give talented players time to play then they can hurt you so we'll have to be focused and ready we train today we prepare and we um, we go to win the game tomorrow night thank you good luck thank you